YouTube, it's your girl K's Beauty World, and I'm back at it again with another freaking video. What video? What video? What? Yes, honey, your girl is back with another freaking video. Now, before I get today into today's video, I just want you guys to hit the subscribe button. I don't know which side it's gonna be on, and also hit the little bell button so you get all the notifications when I do drop a video. Also, down below, hit the like button, share amongst your whole entire YouTube family because your girl is trying to do nothing but positive vibes here on this channel. So, let's get into the video. First off, I want to say I only have six days until my birthday here. I am so freaking excited to be a whole nother age and a whole new journey that I will start amongst myself. Also, I just want to say, you know, I am so glad that... Um, some of the choices that I made have been made and finalized and agreed upon and, you know, everything like that. Because when I tell you that there is nothing but happiness in your life that you need to find, there is nothing but happiness in your life that you need to find. And I have found that for myself and I really take initiative and I really enjoy it because I'm telling you feeling miserable every day is not the way to go. Also... I just wanted to come to you guys and say, or ask, matter of fact, what should I do for my birthday? Now, I probably already got something planned that I don't know about because everybody keeps secrets from me. When is my birthday? Hey! So, um, if you guys got any like thoughts or, you know, whatever, comment down below and tell me what you think I should do for my B-Day, okay? Yeah. Anyways, so shout out to um, my nail crew, Sunny Nails. I love you guys. They're located here in Ohio. They fix me up every time I want to do something with a very great price. Um, so, yeah. Um, what else has been going on with me? Work, 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 work. Your girl been working. You feel me? There's never a day where she don't work, okay? I work hard for what I earn and get in life, and that's what everybody needs to realize. And I know y'all tired of hearing me saying this on my channel, but I'm telling you, these young people nowadays, they don't understand the meaning of working, okay? I started working at 15 and a half when I was able to get a worker's permit, and from then on, honey, I've been working since. And I am glad my mama made me go out there and get a job at 15 and a half with a worker's permit because now I know the true meaning of a life. I know the true meaning of a bills, you know, exactly. And, you know, so forth. So, I mean, people work. What's so hard about working? Nothing. If you can go out there and work and make money, go freaking work and make money. There are people out here that is struggling in life and there are people that medically can't work for certain reasons while other people just sit out here and work like go out the government like come on now if you need the government get the government if you don't need the government get your ass out and work sorry to put that in there but i'm tired of people using the government for an excuse okay i pay too much tax money to be going on people who do not need it and that's how i feel about that situation so how about that Anyways, um, also, so with my new job, they gave me, um, like this big, uh, package of stuff and it was like a bunch of gifts and stuff like that. So first I want to say what the card mentioned was like, you know, welcome to the facility. You've done a good job. Now it's time to, you know, prepare you for what you're going to be doing every day and stuff like that, which I thought was really nice because so many companies don't really necessarily tell you that, especially big corporations, but little corporations, I feel like they think their stuff, they think their staff better. And I feel like that's very appreciative because it's not always about working for a big corporation and then you being a number. It's about you, you know, being out there and you being a person and somebody notices you and understands how you work and say, well, you're doing a great job and you're hearing this from a higher up person or, you know, stuff like that. That's what I tell a lot of people. It is not all the time of how you work and what you do for a living, whether it's in the medical field, whether it's business, whether it's financial, whether it's grocery store, whether it's fast food, whatever the situation may be. I feel like everybody should get a thank you 
every once in a blue moon because a thank you can go a long way in a lot of people's life. And me growing up in the South, it really helps me go a long way with just a simple thank you. It's not even about you speaking to me every day. It's about that thank you, Kayla, for, you know, whatever you've done for me this day or, you know, whatever. I mean, it's just that simple to some people. It's not always about getting points. It's not always about risking your life for something and then nobody says nothing you know it's not all about it's just you know you doing what's best and you getting that thank you at the end of the day point blank period um so yeah so i will be doing a vlog on my birthday for sure it is on a wednesday but i will be doing a vlog actually on my birthday of what i am doing of course i will be going to work because i forgot about my birthday this year i don't know why and i did not take off for either job so i will be working through but i'm still going to celebrate because i've been working so freaking hard in the month of march <laughs> that i am going to celebrate and i'm going to celebrate to the fullest i'm going to celebrate <laughs> for my family because everybody needs it right now. So I'm going to celebrate for everybody. And I'm just going to have a good time. And I'm just going to enjoy, um, you know, the new beginnings that I have going on in my life. And, you know, whatever there may be else to come in my life. Because I, you never know. I mean, I take things day by day. I don't plan anything anymore. Because when you plan things, you know, nothing ever works out in your favor. And then... You're just like so grumpy about it. So why plan things? Just go with the flow of your life and you will be happy. Now, if you want to pick and choose and, and, you know, figure out what's going on in your life and, you know, mentally, and physically sit out and plan your life, then more power to you. But it's not going to work out how you want it. Um, so therefore, my theory on being my new age six days 28 oh god i look good to be 28 <laughs> but anyway um so for me going into the year of me being 28 i uh, feel like there's a lot in store for me i feel like that god has a purpose for me i feel like if there is anything that i strive and want to do mentally physically emotionally then i will do it and i also push myself to become a better person I push myself every day to be a person, a bigger, better, and stronger, and wiser person because I used to let a lot of things get to me. Um, and it, I mean, it still does, but it doesn't get to me to that point where I'm like, okay, hey, you know, Kayla, you just over it. You know, you need to, whatever. I'm not like that anymore. I have a mouth. Like, I talk back. And people hate that. But you know what? I told myself going in the year of 2019, I will not sit here and be disrespected. I will not sit here and let people talk to me any kind of way. I will not always say yes, 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 because I finally learned the freaking word no. So, you know, therefore, it's just like you got to you, you gotta live and learn your life. And it may take you to you 50 years old to figure out your purpose here in life. Or it may take you to 22 to figure out your purpose here on life. But as me being a young person that I am, I feel like my purpose here in the world is to help others. And it could be helping you mentally, physically, emotionally, talking to you, you know, just seeing how your day go. That's all some people really need sometimes. It's just for you to ask that simple question. And they lay their whole heart out to you because not saying that they it's because they don't know you or it's because they need to talk to somebody and they don't know who to talk to or where to go. So always just listen because you never know who you can help. Um, also, you know, when I say my purpose in life is to help others, like I mentioned in one of my previous videos, you know, I was in a grocery store and this man was standing behind me. He really looked like he, you know, didn't have a lot of money in his pocket, but he had to buy like these things. So I told the lady to ring the stuff up with my stuff. You know what I'm saying? Um, and it, I mean, it wasn't that I got all the money in the world because I don't, but it was me doing a good deed and something telling me to help this man. And that man told me, Hey, I really didn't have enough money to buy this stuff for my grandkids, but thank you for doing it because you really didn't have to do it. And like I said, thank you goes a long way, no matter what you're doing no matter what you're doing so if you're a supervisor a manager a owner or anybody that's looking at my video always tell your employees 
thank you. And I guarantee you they will strive harder at their job and to do, you know, more things and, you know, stuff like that. So, like I said, thank you goes a long way. I don't know if it's just because I'm from the South or if it's just something that I always grew up on and my parents taught me that, you know, saying thank you for a lot of things. Yes, ma'am. No, ma'am. Yes, sir. No, sir. And stuff like that. Um, but that, you know, it really, it really um, pushed me to become the best person that I am today. And I thank my parents and I thank everybody who was a part of my life for everything that, you know that they've taught me because I've grown up to be a beautiful young wise lady like literally I budget good I shop good I work hard for what I want and need and I don't have to ask and you know and it feels good when you don't have to ask anybody for anything because you know in your heart deep down that you're working hard in life for what you want and what you you know you want to get my camera keeps like going blurry so i really apologize for that but i mean yeah this is a straight up real world talk like the world is changing out there and i just want all you young people that is below me to understand that get out there do what you gotta do hustle hustle the right way not the wrong way um because that'll never get you nowhere that far in life but behind bars so hustle hard hustle a positive way and just just keep all the negative energy out of your life because once you do that, you will feel like a total different person. And I pray and I hope that when I wake up on my birthday, I will feel like a whole totally new person. And not just because I'm turning a new age, but because I want the world to start seeing me or my followers and my new followers that I am going to have eventually um, to start seeing me, you know, grow from what I was to what I'm becoming to what I'm going to be and, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah, when I wake up on my birthday, I plan on being a total different person. I'm not going to say it's going to take just overnight to do it, but within my 28th year, I will get a lot accomplished and I will do a lot. And I promise and I guarantee you, I will share it with you guys. I mean, just like YouTube, I said... I want to do YouTube. I want to do YouTube. How do I do YouTube? I've been trying to look at people YouTube and it's been very, very complicated because a lot of YouTubers don't want to share their secrets. I mean, you sit here, you support them, you watch them, you give them comments, you know, you like their stuff and, you know, all that great stuff. And then that's fine and dandy, but everybody that's, you know, high up top, I want to look out for the little people that's down below, which I feel a certain type of way of because I feel like, you know, we all as YouTubers are family, even if I don't know you or you don't know me, you know what I'm saying? So I feel like, you know, YouTubers should help the the lower YouTubers and help them, tell them some, some tricks and secrets, tell them what they should improve on. Like I know light and quality is one of the things, but you know, once I get off work, it's getting dark. Well, it's not getting dark right away, but by the time I get settled in and you know, stuff like that, it's starting to get dark. So, you know, I make my video with my light scene in the, in the house. And if I turn on the other, the big light in my kitchen, it's like too, too bright. So I have to have on like one light. Um, so yeah. So that's my goal. That might be my birthday wish, but I can't tell you guys my birthday wish. And when it's my birthday, I want everybody to give me some love and show me some support down in the comment section. Also, you know, call the sister, hit your girl up on Instagram and Facebook, whatever, Twitter. I even got Twitter. Um, I don't be on Twitter like that, but I try. I just don't. T Twitter is just like so drama fies even up higher up and y'all know what i'm talking about i ain't even got to say it um but yeah so um for today it is march the 21st 2019 and i think i am done with this video for today so i will hit you guys up another day to make another dollar and another Holla. Yes. So I will see you guys later. Check me out in my next video, probably tomorrow. I do not know for sure, for sure. But I will be posting soon here, back to back to back. What? <laughs> I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.